So welcome back to Surviving Minecraft. Today, uh, I made a little mistake. Mr. Kitty, can you guess what that mistake was? Did you forget that you're complete and total dark? Yeah. It, yeah, exactly. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, we're in 1.17. So the new Caves and Cliffs update, part one. I was not quite ready for this. I know I'm way behind the curve when it comes to this update, but, uh, there was a reason for that, and now that reason is gone. I was going to build something really cool, but now we're already here. So, I came up with an idea. So, my idea is very simple. What we're going to do is we're going to come up here, we're going to take a look out here, and just want to cry. Because here's the thing. In the new update, because this is an old world, it means that the only way I'm going to be able to find any of these new items is going to be by exploring new chunks that I haven't been to. Now, the problem is that I've explored almost every square inch of this dang map for about 6,000 blocks. So this might be a little tricky, but I'm not gonna let that stop me. No, not at all. Today what we're gonna do is we're gonna go out here and we're gonna try to collect every single new item and block from the new Caves and Cliffs update. Yes, every new item and every new block in the update, including the mobs. So this is gonna be a long episode, so uh, stay tuned. So luckily, one of the things that we're gonna need is actually falling snow, and it just so happened to be snowing because, well, I never sleep, so, both in this game and in real life. But uh, one of the things that we need is we need powdered snow, so in order to collect powdered snow, I need to get a cauldron, and I think, I I, I don't have any. Uh, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to get some cauldrons. Okay then. So this might be a little messed up, but uh, I think I'm gonna have to take the church's holy water. Um, guys, uh, just 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 look away because uh, I need your holy water. Don't worry, I'll return it. But uh, for right now, we need to go get some snow. And uh, yeah, hopefully he'll forgive me. So I guess instead of holy water, we'll just collect some snow. Oh yeah, that's right. That's because I placed a bunch of double layer snow. But this should still be out here, and this should catch it. We might need more cauldrons than that because I don't know. I have no idea how long that's going to take to do it, but, uh, oh, that's weird. There's like a little, oh, that's so weird. I've never seen it do that before. I wonder why it does that. Have you guys ever seen that? That's, that's, that's really weird. Okay. I'm getting distracted, but wow. Okay. So evidently if you look straight up in a snowstorm, there's a little block of air. Hmm. Weird. Okay. Well, since that's enough being distracted, I think what we can do now is while we wait for this to fill up with snow. We need to go and head out and try to find some new chunks so we can start mining some of these new things because a lot of the new items are found inside caves and stuff. So I think that's what we're going to have to do. I don't know if I've explored this way or not. I think I'm just going to kind of go out in the ocean and just kind of see what I can find. So let's do it. Get in the boat, kitty. Don't drown on me, kitty. Come on. Get in the boat. Okay, cool. Okay, perfect. I guess kitty's coming with us after all. Kitty, you be careful back there. I know you tend to get seasick. Okay, so from what I understand, going on the ocean is also a good way to find the amethyst, which is evidently a pretty hard thing to find otherwise. So maybe we'll get lucky and we'll find one just kind of riding out here in the ocean. But uh, I don't know. It's hard to tell because I know I've explored a lot of this area. So we'll see. Oh my gosh. Is that... That's an ocean monument. That was so close to my base I didn't even know it. Okay, well, <laughs> uh, <laughs> we're just going to ignore that that ever existed, but that's okay. All right, so I went all that way for nothing. <laughs> is that something? Is that? Oh, that is. Okay, it is. Wow. Okay, well, we found an amethyst. Nice. Well, this is going to at least be some of the new blocks. Look at that. Oh, you hear that? That is such a cool sound. Oh, wow, and it's fully sealed up, too. Look at that. Okay. Oh, that sounds so cool. I want to plug this thing up so I can really hear it. Hang on. All right, let's hear this. Yes, I want all of this. Okay, we're going to mine this thing out real quick because I need these blocks anyway. Look, I think we need different variations of these crystals, though. I don't know if we can silk touch them. Let's see. So what did that give us? That gave us, oh, medium amethyst. Let's see, what's this? Okay, that's still medium. That's gotta be a large, right? Is that large? Yep, large. Amethyst cluster, okay. So then we need this small one. Is this small? It is. Okay, so we got small, 
Well, where's the large? There's got to be like a large here. I feel like we're missing one. What's that? Nope, still medium. Let me light this sucker up real quick. So I looked at the list and it looks like we're still missing the large one. So I'm going to have to wait for one of these things to grow to be large. But we can also grab these blocks, I'm pretty sure. Yep, as long as it's not the budding amethyst. These ones. Those are the ones that we can't mine, I guess. So we'll just take all these. Yes, I'm going to take all of them. Oh, those sound so cool. I have to say, this is probably one of the more satisfying blocks to mine. Holy cow. Sounds so cool. Do I hear a dolphin? Oh. Buddy, what are you doing in here, buddy? Um, I guess I'm... Oh, no. Dolphin. Oh. Oh. Flipper. Well, so much for dolphin safe mining. Uh, but, uh, yeah. So, I cleared this thing out. And these blocks are incredibly easy to mistake with the regular amethyst blocks. So, I accidentally broke a couple of them. But, uh, yeah. So far, it's doing pretty good. These things are starting to bud. So, we'll almost have all the things we need. But, I mean, take a look at how much I have in here, right? But, let me show you just how much we actually got. Like, uh... Yeah, that is a lot of calcite and a lot of amethyst blocks. Now, I don't know exactly what we're going to do with this, but hey, we can check that off the list. So, yeah, I just need to get a large cluster, and then I can move on to the next thing. Let's see, are any of these large? Is that large? Oh! <gasps> and just like that, I popped it. <laughs> yeah, I, I've, I've done that quite a few times. It's actually really easy to do when you have efficiency. Let's see, is this one good? What size was that? Large. Okay, we got large. Boom. We got all three sizes there, and we got the block. Cool. So now we can go move on to getting the rest of the blocks. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a little pole out of the water so I can find this thing real easy. This way we can at least locate the amethyst. Oh, my God. Is Mr. Kitty all the way out there? Holy cow. That boat really floated away. So maybe we'll get lucky and we can find something down here that we need. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we did find something. Holy cow. That's a lot of bad guys. Okay. This is going to be risky, but uh, let's just go for it anyway. All right. Yep. 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 Come on, creepers. Blow them up. Blow them up. Come on. Come on. Come on. You got it. Come on. Kill him, skeleton. Come on. Ah. Wrong person. Oh. Okay. There we go. Can't see anything. It's so dark. Okay. There we go. Okay. I can see. Oh, wow. Those look so cool. I mean, I know it's just coal, but that looks really cool. Oh, hey there, dude. Why are you all? You got them glow pants on. Holy cow, look at you. What's up, dude? Ooh, bow. Oh, beautiful. Oh, there's so many bad guys. Whoa, it's a baby zombie villager. I didn't even know those things were real. Holy cow, they exist. Wow. Ooh, this is one of the things we need. Okay, glow ink sack. All right, cool. So we can cross that thing off the list. Boom. Ooh. Oh, that's right. Oh, that's right. It breaks down now. So now we get the little raw gold. Oh, that's going to make this so much more efficient so we can actually hold a whole bunch of stuff. Yeah, because I think I can just fortune it. Yes, I can. Okay. Cool. I don't have a crafting table on me, but that's pretty sick. So I could probably do the same thing with the iron. Yep. Okay, there we go. Okay, so we got nine iron and nine gold. So that's cool. So that's going to make it real easy for carrying a bunch of this stuff. Oh, that's awesome. I'm so glad they did that. All right, all right. Ooh, copper. There we go. Found some raw copper. Okay. Oh, look. It's a nice little batch. Can't see anything because it's so dang dark. Boy, I really miss having that Optifine. So we still need to find some of the stuff that's like way down here. Because we're going to have to go pretty deep to find the deep slate. And we got to find all the deep slate ores. Okay, okay. Oh, look at this. Oh, well, <laughs> speak of the devil. All right, we found some already. That was easy enough. Take some of these since we don't have these yet. Those are pretty cool looking. What is that? Deep slate coal? Okay. Then we'll get some of this deep slate. Is it different if you silk touch it, I wonder? I'm going to silk touch some and see. Deep slate? cobbled it is different okay all right cool so that's interesting ooh. sketchy Ooh, there we go deep slate is that gold yeah i don't have that yet so that's something nice Ooh, there we go okay 
Oh, I broke it. Whoops. I need the deep slate ore. There we go. Okay. Nice. Getting there. Making some progress. Ooh, there we go. Iron. Yep. Oh, I broke it. Oops. <laughs> I need to grab the ore. I'm over here just breaking it. There we go. Okay, we got one. All right. Let's see if we can find anything else floating around. Ooh. Okay. What's this? This is the new block. Oh, I'm full. Uh, <laughs> let's see. I got a lot of junk. There we go. What is this? Tough. Okay, so we found tough. I wonder if that builds into anything. It's kind of an interesting looking block. I mean, I'm, I'm, I don't hate it, but it's not like, oh yeah, give me some of that tough. You know, like tough. Yeah, that's what I want. Just a bunch of tough. Not exactly. I will find you, diamonds. I don't know where you are, but I will find you. I know you're in here somewhere. Lord knows where, but we will find you. Okay, I'm going to try going back up because I need to empty my inventory. We'll go take a look at what we got so far and kind of see how we're doing. But uh, I'm going to have to come back into this mine, I think, because right now I am completely full. Here we go. This island should work just perfect for what I want to build to dedicate this entire thing to. Kitty, you okay over there? Oh, just plotting the destruction of my enemies. Okay, buddy. Um, <laughs> let's just start digging this thing out, level this thing out, so I can show you what we're going to do to make this, this collection very special. Holy crap. What is with all these drowns? You tell them, kitty. Holy crap. Whoa. They dropped copper. Wait, what? Since when? Okay, so evidently drown... Okay, these guys are really annoying. Good job, kitty. You're doing a good job. But evidently drowns will drop copper. I can't believe that. My first copper ingot was from a drown. <laughs> Go figure. All right, so I need to get at least one of each item. There's so many different things you can do with deep slate. Holy cow. All right, we should be able to do this. Yeah, okay, so now we got cracked deep slate tiles and cracked deep slate bricks. So that's good. We can cross those two off the list. So far, so good. So we got a pretty good amount of things so far, but we got a lot more to get. It's okay, progress is progress. My God, there are so many of these phantoms. I haven't been sleeping, but geez Louise, that is a lot. Mr. Kitty over here working his butt off. Good job, Kitty. Okay, so now that those guys are done, uh, let me show you my plan. Okay, so if y'all know me, you know that I have not built a house yet in Minecraft. I literally sleep in an igloo. So, I thought what better way to use these blocks than to make our first ever house. It's probably gonna be the worst house you've ever seen, but, uh, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. So let's do it. I mean, as you can see, I've already got a ton of these things for the deep slate. I think I'm only missing a couple variations of deep slate. I think I need diamond ore, emerald ore, and then there's like an infested block. I don't know how we're going to find the infested block, but uh, yeah, for right now, this is pretty good, I think. So we'll just start building out the foundation of the house and just kind of go from there. It's going to be an ugly house, but it's going to be a house nonetheless. And that's all that really matters. I mean, look at these blocks. These blocks are beautiful. I guess we'll put walls in the corners, yeah? It's not going to be a very big house because I don't think there's that many uh, blocks that are available to build with, but we'll see. You know, we'll, we'll, we'll see what we can do here. What is this? One, two, three. So if we have three in the middle there, we'll do five here. So one, two, three, four, five. Bam, we'll put one there. All right, we'll put that there. Let's see, we got some cobble. We can put that there. Where's the other wall? There it is. There's the other wall right there. Boom, so we're gonna have like a, like a deep slate foundation, essentially. Hmm, could be interesting. Bam. I am. Look at that. Okay. All right. We're getting somewhere. This is kind of a house. This is a not a very good house, but it's a house. You know, hey, is what it is. I guess we'll put the basalt there. Maybe I'll. I got the tough. Oh, dang. These things just keep coming in trying to kill me. There we go. So there's one wall pretty much. Not bad. Not bad. Yeah, we'll do this. We'll do this. This will be fine. That'll be fine. Just like that. We can just do like a, a wall of ores, you know, something like this. Look at that. All right. Cool. Got that one, beautiful. And we got the gold one. We'll save room for the diamonds and the other ones. Hey buddy, I'm, I'm over here building a house. Can't you see that? Get out of my house, you don't belong here. All right, these guys need to die. Those guys are so annoying. Come here, Mr. Kitty. You sit there. I need to go kill this thing. Yeah. No more. 
You know what? I'm just going to sleep. It's fine. We don't need the snow right now. This will help. It'll be okay. It'll be fine. There we go. All right. Cool. I guess we'll put copper there. So that's something, right? Yeah. Okay. So we kind of covered up our couch, but that's okay. So I guess we'll put some of those up over here. Yeah. There we go. Put the copper block in that one. Yeah. There we go. Now we're starting to get a house. It's kind of housey. We need, we need something up here, but, uh. Uh, you know, hey, it's it's okay. It's not the perfect house, but it's a house so far. We'll go, boom. We'll take this little guy here. Plop that there for some color. Yeah, okay. All right. Yeah, we got something. It's, it's, uh... <laughs> yeah, it, it's, it's something. <laughs> okay, well, uh, before we finish, I guess we should go and get some more blocks. I guess I'll plop that there for now but um yeah so we'll do the slabs towards the end those will be for the roof i guess we do have copper so we can see what we can make with the copper let's see what do we got um okay four blocks i guess we do have to kind of have this stuff aged so we may as well do that i think you're supposed to spread it apart if i'm not mistaken so we'll just have this thing do its thing because the copper is going to be a big part of it so we need to go get a lot more copper and a couple more rare blocks. But I say we just go out and go check it out in the mine again. And we'll see what we can find. We need to find an abandoned mine shaft somewhere, hopefully. Um, but yeah, so so far so good. Mr. Kitty, we got to go find an abandoned mine shaft. Well, where would you find one of those? Yeah, I don't, I, I, don't, I don't know where they are. But I did see a ravine out that way. So I might go do some swimming. But uh, I don't think you should go with because it's underwater. Oh, well, yes, I'll, I'll yeah. stay here. Yeah, exactly. I, I figured you would understand. Uh, I'll work on my okay. cat. All right, well, bye, kitty. Oh, well. we'll see you in a bit. All right, we're back out at the amethyst, so let's go back down and see what we can find. Well, hello there. Oh. Okay. Ooh, hey, there we go. I need these. Cool. Well, first, let me get this iron, but, uh, wow, that's awesome. Oh, shoot, that's not what I want. Ah, I can't see. Okay, well, either way, this is what I wanted. That should do it. Did we get both? Yeah, dripstone block and pointed dripstone. Nice. Cool. I was looking for this stuff. Awesome. Boom. So that's one more thing we can cross off the list. Nice. Oh, look at that. It's a glow squid in the wild. Holy cow. You're so cool, dude. Too bad I got to kill you. Oh, that's cool. He goes dark when you do that. Sorry, buddy. I just want your little ink sacks. Oh, we got three of them. <laughs> oh, hey. Holy cow. It's a, uh, uh, what do they call that thing? Uh, axolotl. That's right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Ooh, I don't have a bucket. Ooh. Ooh, I don't have a bucket. That's not good. Okay, don't go anywhere, little dude. Don't go anywhere. I'm gonna go make a little thing. Don't die on me. Do they die from that? I don't, I don't know. Okay, here we go. Can I make... Oh, I don't have crafting table. Oh, uh, I need to furnace this. Oh, my goodness. Well, where'd he go? Hello? Axolotl. Okay, I need you, Mr. Axolotl. Don't you go dying on me, okay? I'm going to come back for you. Okay, I guess I'm going to have to go all the way back just to get a dang crafting table because I'm going to need to catch that axolotl. Because I can't catch him without a dang bucket, and I can't make a bucket without a crafting table. Oi. Isn't that just, like, total Minecraft things that have happened, you know? Hey, what you doing in my boat? Yeah, my boat. That's my boat. Well, we're back again. Yep, Mr. Kitty, we're back yet again. Back already? Yeah, well, you know, I'm not the best at this game, okay? I'm trying, okay? I'm trying my best. Oh my god, you suck at this. Well, that's, that's not very nice. But anyway, uh, let's see. So, on that run, I managed to get two more blocks that we need, being the dripstone and dripstone block. Got a little extra stuff that we could use for some other stuff, but nothing new. So, we've got a pretty good head start so far, but, man, we still got a lot more to go. So, I guess we'll just plop that there for now. And I'll save the dripstone for the roof, because that might be a little cool to look at. Okay, so we need a bucket so that way we can get the axolotl, since I left this one here, because I was not using my brain, but that's okay. All right, this time I'm taking the crafting table with me, because, uh, yeah, I'm not going to deal with that, but... uh. Let's go see if that axolotl's still there, because I would really like to get that little guy. Well, I couldn't find the axolotl, unfortunately, so I think what we're going to have to do is try to find a new place. Because I just spent about a half an hour and didn't find any new blocks down there. So, 
What I may need to look out for is going to be like a uh, mountain or something because I think we'll have a better chance of finding the emerald stuff in there. But also, we need to find like an abandoned mine shaft. Haven't found one of those yet, and I'm not sure if there's going to be one around here. But I think we'll have better luck if we get on land, so we'll see. Why is this glowing? What is this? Oh, the, the uh, oh, what's that called? Glow lichen. That's the stuff. I need to get that. I don't have that yet. Hang on. Please don't attack me. All I want is this. There, I think I got it. Woo! Get me out of here. All right, I think I saw another ravine down here somewhere. Let's see. Yep, okay, here we go. Let's see if we can go find some more of these ores down here. Aha, here's a little entrance. It's a little bit dark, but uh, we'll see what we can find. Ooh. Oh, hey, there we go. Look at that. Beautiful. Cool. Let's let's grab that little sucker right there. Beautiful. I was wondering if we were ever going to find the lapis. Okay, cool, cool, cool. We'll add that to the list. Oh, there it is. Holy cow. Okay, cool. We found it. We found the diamond. Oh, beautiful. Oh, beautiful. We got a couple of them, I think. Let's see if I can get it. Oh, thank goodness the lava didn't keep flowing. There we go. We got it. We got the diamond ore. Oh, that's beautiful. All right. We got the diamond ore, finally. So now we just need to figure out where we can find some emerald ore. My goodness, it's so dark and hard to see in here. <laughs> Jesus, get me out of here. Yeah, we're doing pretty good. Oh, we need to find copper, too. We need to find deep slate copper ore. That's the other thing. Okay, well, we can find that. All right, got ourselves some copper ore. All right, we crossed that one up the list. We still need to get our uh, copper deep slate, but hey, that's something. Hmm. Ooh, here we go. This might be interesting. Here we go. Ooh, axolotl. Axolotl. Okay, bucket of water. Come here, bucket. Come here, Mr. Axolotl. Come on, buddy. All right, where'd he go? He was just in here. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Come here, you. Oh, boy. Come here. Come here, you. Got him. Oh, that's so cool. We got an axolotl. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, cool. So we got an axolotl in a bucket. Oh, my goodness. That's so cool. There's another one. Oh, my goodness. Can I place this underwater? Let's see. Oh, I can. Okay. Let's go ahead and grab this guy, too. Axolotl, I see you floating around here somewhere. Where'd you go? Oh. Oh, is he getting hurt? Where'd he go? Oh. Oh, he's getting hurt. There he is. You get him. No! Oh, he died. He died to the lava. Poor little axolotl. Oh, poor little guy. What's up, glow squid? Oh, I can't just let you live. This is. Well, at least we got one axolotl out of the ordeal. Mm. My goodness, we got a little bucket of axolotl. He's so cute in a bucket. Ah, gotta love him. Hello. 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 <laughs> I love those little guys. Mr. Kitty, I'm back. Take a look at what I found, Mr. Kitty. Look at this. You ready for this? Oh, get that thing away from me. Look at this. Oh, my What's God. that, Kitty? Really done it now, Where'd he go? Wait, actually, where did he go? Oh, there he is. What even is that? Oh, come here, you. Where are you going? Hey, quit trying to run away from me. Little black all trying to run away. Kitty, get out the water. You're going to drown. After seeing that, I won't. <laughs> I just had a thought. Can Axolotl go in furnace? Well, he can, but he doesn't get cooked. Uh, that would be funny, though. Kitty, do you think we can cook him? Oh, I certainly hope you can. Let's uh, do a quick little test, because I am very curious. Can you cook? Oh, well, it would have been a good shot. It would have been funny. Oh, well, I tried. <laughs> I thought that would have been an interesting situation. Uh, maybe there's something wrong with me, but anyway, it's okay. Okay, good. This thing's starting to age, so that's a good sign. Kitty, would you stop drowning? 
After seeing that, I want to die. Good lord. Okay, so let's start adding this thing up. And I had an idea while I was out there doing this, was that these stairs... I could actually use those stairs for something else. I'm going to use those things in a different spot. So I think what I'm going to do here is I'm going to place this... We'll place this. This is going to be like our, our uh, ore wall for now. <laughs> I'm going to put the stairs like this. Watch. Here we go. This is going to be cool. Bam. I think I can go. Yeah, there we go. See? See? It's like a little window. And then, bam. We got ourselves a little deep slate window. Very nice. Very nice. Nice and snazzy. Yeah, if I do say so myself. Yeah. It's like a little porthole. I can see dirt. It's the best window ever. Uh, but yeah. Oh, look. Here we go. Here's a new one. Nice. We'll put that in here in the pile. Okay. I'll put the dripstone like right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That works. Kind of dumb, but that'll work. I'm going to move that because I want it to be over here because we're going to put all this junk over here on this wall. It's going to be the junk wall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That works. Well, it's the next day and the uh, 118 or so items definitely didn't seem like such a big task until I started this thing. But, uh, yeah, so far I claimed a whole bunch of these amethyst crystals. Right now I've got eh, about a stack and a half, so that's not too bad. So we can make a couple items out of that. But what we need to do now is we need to go find ourselves a mountain biome. Because uh, I still need to find some emerald ore, and I need to find some copper ore that's in the uh, deep slate. So I think that's what we'll do next. I just got to kind of go drop off some of this stuff. And, uh, yeah, we'll get started searching for that thing. So let's do it. Kitty, check this out. What is it this time, Dubs? Isn't that just one of the coolest looking blocks you ever seen? It looks like a purple ingot to me. Well, I mean, I thought it was pretty cool. Well, that's because you're a total dope. Well, okay, well, fine. I'll take it and have fun with it then. Fine. Jeez. Kitty is such a jerk sometimes. Let's see. Do we have what we need to make? Ah, we do. Okay, so we can make a spyglass. Eh, it's just like Optifine. But, uh, since I don't have Optifine... I can look at Kitty right in the face. Well, at least mine's prettier than yours. Now that's just that's just mean, Kitty. That, that's just mean. <laughs> anyway, all right. So I guess that's one more item we can cross off the list. Can we make the tinted glass? Ooh, we can. Okay then. Nice. Oh, nice. It looks a lot like black stained glass, but I guess this stuff. The good thing is, it'll block light. So like, I guess this stuff's pretty useful for making different farms and whatnot because it's like one of the few transparent blocks that actually blocks light, so it'll still be perfectly dark. So that's pretty interesting. I kind of like the way that thing looks. Kind of like wearing sunglasses, but not really. That's interesting. Well, anyway. All right, so that's one more block we can check off the list. We have a lot more to get to, but uh, I think what we need to do now is we need to go ahead and try to find a mountain because I need to get some deep slate copper because I think that's one of the ores we're missing and some deep slate emerald. So I'm going to try to go get that. I think there was a mountain out this way somewhere that I haven't explored yet. If not, I'm just going to kind of keep going. There's tons of mountains in this world. If we just keep going a straight line, eventually we'll hit something. So that's what we'll do. Ah, speak of the devil, that looks kind of like a mountain. I wonder if there'll be any goats up here because we still need to find a goat. Look at the size of that one. Holy cow. See if we can actually use this thing. I see nothing up there. Absolutely nothing. Oh, that's interesting. I just realized if you hit F1 when you're in here, it makes the screen go away. So you're not stuck with this little thing. <laughs> okay, so it is just Optifine, essentially. Look, I can see the dirt and the chicken. Louie, hey. What's up, dude? <laughs> That's pretty cool. What is that over there? Just a little moo cow. I kind of want to see if there's any goats on this mountain. Because if there were going to be goats, I would imagine there's goats up there. Oh my god, Louie, how the hell did you get up here? Why are the chickens on the top of the mountain? Louie, what's gotten into you, buddy? What are you doing all the way up here, dude? Oh, uh, you know, just pooping on the cows below. Oh, okay then. Fair enough. All right. Easy way down. Here we go. Uh-oh. I missed. Oh, I know I got it. Oh. Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo, boy. I thought I was dead. <laughs> okay. I'll take that one. 
Well, as much as I wanted this to be a nude chunk, it's definitely not because I'm not finding any deep slates. So I think I'm gonna have to head a little bit further out. All right, please let this be considered a mountain. Okay, this has got to be a mountain area. Oh, I thought that was a goat. Ah, it's a dang sheep, you dang imposter. I thought you were a goat. You lie. This has got to be new chunks, though. A goat. He's stuck in the air, but it's a goat. Oh, God, there he is. Okay. Well, this is definitely a new chunk now. All right, so we just got to capture those guys. Luckily, I remember correctly. I believe. Uh, yes, I do. I have some leads. All right, Mr. Goat. It's time for you to come with me, sir. Come here. What you doing over there? I need at least two of you. What are you barking about? They make some wonky noises. Let's get in the boat. Come on. Get in the boat. There we go. Cool. All right. Let's go find a hole and start digging. That 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 doesn't sound right, but you know what I mean. Okay, you two. Be safe over there. I'm going to go start digging a hole, okay? Um... I think I'm just gonna dig a hole right here and just kind of go down until we find some deep slate. What's up, Capper? Ooh, there we go. There's some new blocks. What is this? Oh, wait a second. Is this another? It is. Oh my God, it's another. Um. Uh. Yeah, amethyst geode. Holy crap! We dug right into an amethyst geode. Oh my goodness. Okay. Wow, I didn't expect that. <laughs> All right, cool. Let me just drop all this junk over here that I don't need. Yep. 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 Bye. Okay. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, it is a straight-up amethyst. Wow. Would you look at that? Well, I think that's good enough. I think we cleared enough of that out that we can keep on moving. We got about another... Oh... 20 levels to go till we get down to where we need to be, so yeah, we'll get there eventually. Oh, hey, look at that. Oh, well, we're definitely in the right spot. It's not the right uh, type of emerald ore, but we're getting there. Ooh, look at this. Okay. Shoot, I wish I had made it here first because I just found a whole bunch of good stuff. Deep Slate Diamond and all this other stuff right here. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, that's an infested block. Oh. Oh, I think I got one. Did I get it? Did I get an infested one? Oh, one of them broke. Oh, man. Those things are hard to find. I wonder... I wonder if there's more in here. Holy cow. Oh, my God. Is that it? Is that the stuff I've been looking for? It is. Okay. Deep Slate Emerald. Nice. Oh, dude, that took forever to find. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so we have one. So the only other thing we need is deep slate copper ore, which is probably somewhere out here, and then the infested thing. Now, I've killed a couple of these things by accident, but, man, finding an infested one that's not actually broken is really hard to find. So I guess I need to find an infested one because I've already broken, like, three of them. So uh, I'm going to keep digging. Oh, I think I'm full. Do I have everything? What? Oh! We got one! Infested Deep Slate. Nice! Okay, cool. So, then all we need now is we're going to need to get... Um, we just need the Copper Deep Slate. Wow! Holy crap, that's awesome. Well, I would call that a huge win. Like, uh, <laughs> who would have thought we would have been able to find all that shit? But uh, we got a lot more to find still. We still gotta get these goats all the way back over to the island, so uh, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna hook them up to some leads, and hopefully, yeah, okay, that should work. Oh, whatever floats your goat, okay. <laughs> I guess that works, cool. I guess we got some goats. <laughs> oh man, I guess this is how we're gonna do this. We'll just kinda take them over there. Okay, goats, it's time to roll. So I don't know if you guys ever played the game called Worms, but this reminds me of that because in there, there's a little weapon you can use and it's called a goat on a rope. And, uh, well, I'd say I got a goat on a rope here. <laughs> oh, here we go. We made it. We made it back to the island. Home sweet home. Hey, Mr. Kitty, take a look at what I brought. Take a look at these guys. 
Yeah. What are those? I, I, well, I mean, um, they're goats. They look like sheep with horns. Yeah, I mean, uh, well, well, don't worry about it. it, it it'll it all make sense later, okay? Just, just, just relax. What would you even do with them? Kitty's not too happy about this one, but uh, let me see if I got a uh, uh, thing I can mount these guys to. Looks like I'm gonna have to do this. All right, we got ourselves a little fence post, so we'll 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 post these suckers up. All right, goats, y'all get to chill there, okay? All right, so now we got some goats, nice and chilling. So uh, yeah, pretty good so far. Whoa! The hell are you doing? What the hell are you doing? Okay. Evidently they can jump. <laughs> okay. All right, guys. You guys chill out. Jeez. Okay, let's see. Let's get this sucker in there because this is the most rare of them all. This dang emerald ore is insane. Like, that was so hard to find. I can't even... <laughs> I think that's harder to find than diamonds, honestly. That thing is so rare. So, let's see. So, we still need the copper deep slate. But we got every other deep slate ore. So, that's really good. And we got the regular copper ore. I might even add the ores because of the new texture. So, I don't know. We'll see. But, uh, yeah. Let's see. What else did we get? That's right. We had the infested deep slate. So, I need to find a place for that. Hmm... I want it to make sense, so we'll put it right there. That thing's pretty rare. I just need to be very careful not to break that block. And put you right there, sure. Okay, so there's the glow lichen. Okay, so I got all the copper just kind of sitting out. I guess this is how you're supposed to do it. It seems to be working. I don't know how long it's going to take for this stuff to fully age. Like, look, this one already aged. I just placed it. But, uh, yeah, we'll have to just wait and see, I guess. But uh, the goats are just chilling over there. They're doing good. So our house is coming together. Oh, okay. <laughs> These goats are something else. They just go ham. Well, I guess they're not pigs, but you know what I mean. But uh, anyway, so let's go see if we can find some more of this deep slate ore. We need to find the copper deep slate. Um, and then we should be good for all the deep slate ore. So, yeah. So now we're just going to wait on this to age and see if we can find the stuff. So let's go do it. There we go. That's a new chunk. You can see the glowing stuff in there. So that tells me that's like glow lichen or something. Looks like this thing's hollow. Hey. Oh, wow, look, dripstone just chilling in here. I know it's, like, really dark, but, uh, that's pretty cool. Ooh, more copper. Oh, 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 that could have been deadly. Oh, 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 this place is dangerous. Holy cow. <gasps> there it is. Okay. Oh, Dude, sick. Okay, we got it. Okay, so we got all the... Oh, did I just lose? I just lost one. Uh, Did we at least get most of them? Yeah, okay, we did. Cool, so we got... Let's see, is there any more? Okay, so we got the deep slate copper ore, so we got all the deep slates, so that's awesome. Nice. Okay, so we just have a couple more to get. I think we have all the deep slate variants now. So now what we really need to do is find ourselves... Oh my goodness, get out of my face. We need to find ourselves a, not a ravine, but a abandoned mine shaft because I believe there's some loot in there that we need to find. I think it's for the moss blocks, if I'm not mistaken. But, uh, yeah, so I guess that's the next thing we're going to look for. It's going to be an abandoned mine shaft. Oh, boy. Oh, dude, dude, okay. Okay. I forget what the other thing is that we're looking for, but I think it's glow berries and then maybe a moss block or something. I think those are the other two items that we need to find. But I think you can only find them in here. Uh-oh. That's not good. That's a cave spider. Here we go. Come on, baby. There they are. Glow berries. Okay, we got the glow berries. Okay, that's something. That's huge. That's something we were looking for. We take those. Was this Riptide 3? Oh, I mean, you know, hey, I mean, I'll take that too. I mean, you know, shoot, I ain't gonna leave that. No, thank you, no, sir. Okay, so I just did some research, and the moss block is what you have to find inside shipwrecks. So we got what we need from this place. Now I just need to figure out how the hell I get out of here. Oh, those are cave spiders. No, thank you, sir. If I remember correctly, I placed all the torsos on the left side. So if they're on the right, I should be able to find my way out of here. Yeah, okay, here we go. All right, so now we just got to find our way. Oh, there we go. All right, that works. Let's go up to the surface. Oh, hey, there's my boat. Well, that was convenient. It was right here. Okay, then. 
Well, I'll take that. And look, there's the geodes. That wasn't very far at all. Okay, cool. Sometimes you get lost when you go in the caves. At least it's kind of crazy how they're all kind of like interconnected though. Well, I would say we got a couple of the things we needed. Now we just need to go ahead and find the rest of the stuff. Okay, so I guess what I want to do is I want to put this up here somewhere. Let's see, since this is our ore wall. There we go. We got a nice little deep slate ore wall going. All right, so I'm going to put these glow berries in here where they're nice and safe. So I guess I'll take some of this calcite out of here because we don't really need that right now. That's We got plenty of that. Um, and some of the stuff we're going to have to wait until we get some item frames up. And I need to get these slabs up. So I think what we're going to do is while we're waiting on this copper to oxidize, I need to go get some wax. Luckily, I got a bee farm. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over to the bee farm, get a whole bunch of honeycomb, and then I'll be right back. But before I go too far, I need to make sure that I'm always carrying these emeralds on me. Because I guess one of the other things we need is to trade with a wandering trader. And yet if he shows up and I don't have emeralds, that's going to be a problem. Hopefully four will be enough. Uh, guys... You're kind of in my boat. Uh oh. All right, let's just bail. <laughs> they can't catch me. I am speed. There we go. Hello, world. Thank God I got this bee farm. Come here, Mr. Bees. I'm coming to get some honeycomb. Oh, I made a bunch of honeycomb blocks. I uh, better go see how it's been doing. It has been running. Oh, there we go. All right. I don't think we're going to need much more than two stacks. I don't know how much it uses, but I think that should be more than enough. Thanks again, bees. Y'all are doing a really bang-up job out there. I need to get back to work, though. Thanks again. <laughs> oh, man, I love this place. Farewell, bees. I'll see you soon. All right, well, let's get back over to the island, shall we? I think, can I just do this and then wax it? Like, just go like that and then... Oh, uh, you can. Nice. Okay, so you don't have to do it in the crafting table. Nice. Do they have, like, a regular slab? No, they don't. Huh. Well then, so we'll take this and we'll make one of each. So we got one of those, some of those, some of these, you know. And then what we can do is we can then layer these on there some way. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, we need to keep it to where it looks really bad. <laughs> oh my gosh, it looks so bad. Here we go. We'll wax that sucker. And then we still got to figure out what we're going to do with these slabs. Not quite sure yet, but we'll figure something out. Maybe we can do something like this, right? Right there. There we go. We starting to get a roof. Did I wax that? No, I didn't. Okay, there we go. Okay, so there we go. We got a little bit of a roof going, you know, a little bit of a house. It's a <laughs> it's quite a joke of a house, but it's a house nonetheless. What am I building? Well, I guess while we're waiting on this stuff to oxidize, let's go check out and see if we can find some dang shipwrecks. I don't know how hard it is to find this moss block or whatever, but evidently it's somewhere inside one of these shipwrecks. So I'm gonna have to try to find the new chunks and then see if we can find some shipwrecks. I just said that three times, didn't I? Hmm, come on boats, where are you at? You know, now that I think about it, I think this update makes oceans actually really relevant now because a lot of the stuff you need to find is just way easier to do on the ocean. It's interesting. Shipwrecks, what's that? Oh, is that a boat? That's a boat, ship ahoy interesting interesting let's see here okay come on let there be something good in here anything in here what's in the well i mean hey you know it's iron and emeralds we'll take that sure why not come on are you gonna be the one Ooh, that's a lot of poison potatoes oh my goodness so much i you know i i would take these but i don't really need them i have them but um well that's a downer what about in here? Anything in here? Uh, hidden treasure. I wonder if you can find it in the hidden treasure, maybe. I mean, it's worth looking, I guess. Should be under here. No? Come on, you should be right here. Ah, there she is. Well, we got some diamonds and a bunch of iron and whatnot, but uh, I do not see a moss block. So that's unfortunate. We'll take the heart of the sea. Why not? The rest of the stuff I don't really need, but uh, yeah. All right, then. Well, this thing's actually sunken. Holy cow. Come on. What is this? Buried treasure? I don't think we need it, but... Uh, 
hate leaving stuff. Please be the one that gives us what we need. Uh, no moss block. Uh, the potatoes are cool. Suspicious stew is always fun. Okay, I can't see anything. Oh, dear. Nope, doesn't like that one. And how about this one? Oh, yep, blind again. Okay. Why does anybody drink the suspicious stew anyway? Well, I mean, that's a lot of free iron. Uh, but still not what we're looking for. All right, back on the road we go. Or ocean, I guess. I think I found another ship. Yep, I'm pretty sure that's what that is. Come on. Uh, bamboo, that's cool. I didn't know you could find bamboo in these things. I mean, I don't really need the bamboo, but still. Yep, only one chest on this ship. Well, I looked for it, but I didn't find anything else under there. That's that's kind of sad. Although we did find this cool iceberg biome, so that's kind of cool. Man, I just don't know if, if it's going to be like in the buried treasure or if it's in the actual treasure ship. That's the part I don't know. Oh, hey, there we go. There's another one. All right, ship, come on. Please be the lucky one. Are you going to be the one that does it? Come on. I mean, we keep finding lots of iron and stuff, but it's not what we're looking for, unfortunately. Come on. Empty map, that's cool, but another buried treasure map. Ugh. Oh my goodness, is it our island? I think this one's actually at our island. Are you kidding me? Our island had a buried treasure the whole time? If this thing actually has the moss block, I swear. Come on now, where are you at? There it is. Come on, nope. Okay, nope. We got a lot of emeralds out of this ordeal. Oh, he broke my boat. Oh, you broke my boat. What is with these tridents? He broke my boat. Where is my boat? Did he literally break it, break it? Uh, hello? I think he broke my boat. This fool broke my boat. Wait, I see it. Is that my boat? That's, no, that's rotten flesh. There it is. Okay. Holy cow. Okay, I found another one. All right, come on. Please, please, please. Uh, <laughs> normally, I wouldn't be so sad to find that, but uh, that's not what I'm looking for. Okay, come on, baby. Is this going to be the lucky one? Come on. I don't know how many more of these things I can find. Come on. Please. Uh, uh no mouse block. Just a bunch of suspicious stew. Well, that's lame. Just can't wait to get on the road again. Is this boat? I think I've been here before. Come on, please tell me this is not the same boat I've been to twice. Oh my gosh, I'm doing circles. I've been here already. Ah! Please, 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 please be the right one. I swear, I've searched so many of these ships. Come on. Oh, I've already been here. Yeah, I've already been here. <laughs> no! <laughs> Back here. Uh, <laughs> pain. Well, on the flip side, that is a really cool coral reef. <laughs> if I ever need coral, I definitely know where to go. Is that a, is that a shipwreck? I think it is. It's a really weird shape for one, but yeah, it's a shipwreck, all right. Oh, no, it's just buried in the coral. I don't know why that was tripping me up so bad. Okay. Let's see. Uh, oh, there it is. Oh, my God, finally. Oh, thank you, Jesus. That took me so long. Oh, my God. All right, well, I guess this coral reef is the lucky coral reef. Can't believe it, but we finally got the moss blocks. We need to get back to Mr. Kitty and show him what we got and also figure out just what blocks we can get out of this thing. If I'm not mistaken, there's quite a lot. So let's go find out. Oh, it's weird. This is feeling like my second home. It's a good thing we're making a house out of 1.17 blocks. All right, boys. We made... Okay, Mr. Goat. Jesus. <laughs> Calm down, buddy. Calm down. <laughs> Kitty, take a look at what we got. We got this really cool new block. You want to see it? It's called the moss block. See? Well, that looks a lot like grass. Yeah. He, he's never impressed. Okay, Kitty. Well, fine. You may not be impressed with it, but that took me a really long time to find. Like, an incredible amount of time. But, uh, yeah. On the plus side, we managed to find a whole lot of, like, 
gold and just diamond and iron like shipwrecks are actually really profitable not to mention all the emeralds we got i mean literally over a stack of emeralds that's pretty insane uh if that gives you any idea just how many shipwrecks i went through uh but we found it we finally found it so i say fk eating my lunch and i come back to this screen um oh it was a trident oh my god look at that holy cow Okay, well, that explains how I died. Jeez, I thought I was safe. Look at all these tridents. Holy cow, did they kill the goats? No. Okay, thank goodness the goats are fine. Let's see, did we miss any items? Uh, yeah, where is my other pick? Did one of these zombies wind up with it? Don't look at me. Did this guy take it? You. My pick's missing. Uh, is it you? Oh, he's got it. There he is. You have my pick, you little... Give me that. I mean, you little, uh... Nice little guy that disappeared there. <laughs> uh, yeah. Anyway. Oh, Dolphin. You shouldn't be out here. Dolphin, come on. Come on. Get back in the, get back in the water. Get back in the water. What are you doing? How did you end up here? Come on. Get out of here. The goats are gonna kill you. Come on, come on, get in the water, get in the water. There you go, go on, there you go. Okay, we saved the dolphin. All right, check that off the list. Okay, so note to self, don't go AFK here because zombies will come and kill you. Good to know. So anyway, I needed to do something with this moss block. Hey, you know where I put these what blocks? You, are you dancing over there? It's in your mom's house. <laughs> um, okay. Booga booga. Oh, Jesus Christ, that scared the shit Boom. out of me. Dude, Endermen, they are something else. So from my understanding, what we can do is we can make like a little patch of dirt, right? And I think if we put it in the center here, because it won't convert sand, I think, if I'm not mistaken. And then if we take our little bone meal here, let's see, if we do this, we should get a couple of things. Uh, well, I mean, we did get some more. Okay, look, there's moss carpet. Okay, that's new. Yeah, moss carpet, look at that. It's like grass. It's like AstroTurf. We could do like a little AstroTurf area. All right, so, and then I think, can I do it again? Yeah, there we go. Okay, we got the little bushes. Do I just chop them? Oh, there it is. Okay, yep, cool. And then this is the azalea, right? I think, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see, what's this? Okay, this is azalea right here, and then this is flowering azalea. Now, I think if we do grass here, right? So let's just do regular grass. We'll do something like that. And then I think you have to put the flowering azalea. Let's see, if we put that there. I think when we do the bone meal on this guy. Come on, grow. There it is. Okay, did that do it? Did that create... The question is, I'm trying to get rooted dirt. Ooh, that looks like it. I think that might have done it. Yeah, and look. Oh, we got the cool little leaves now, too. Oh, that is so awesome. Well, we're definitely going to shear this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, look at that. Those are so cool. Now, I know these are these are just, like, decoration, but, like, still, that's, that's a really cool block. I mean, there's a lot of cool stuff you can do with that. But this, this is the rooted dirt. Well, first off, with the rooted dirt, if I'm not mistaken, if we bone meal this thing from below, we should get, yep, there it is. Oh, okay, I guess I need to, can I shear him? Yeah, okay, I can shear them. Nice. Okay, cool. So we got hanging roots now. Cool, cool, cool. We're getting there. We're getting a lot of items, that's for sure. This thing is taking me so long that I'm actually starting to grow a beard. <laughs> oh, boy. But anyway, I wanted to show you something I discovered out here near our base, and that is if you look down here, you can see that there's some logs down there. Oh, hey, Mr. Squid. But uh, <laughs> let me show you what was hiding right next to us this entire time. Yep, that's right. It's a shipwreck. And, uh, wouldn't you believe it? Moss blocks. Right there. The whole time. They were right in front of our feet. <sighs> but other than that discovery, I've done a little bit of fishing for some axolotls. I'm trying to catch as many of them as I can. Because evidently there's a lot of different colors. And so far we got four of them. I'm not sure how many there are total. But we do have to finish building the house. This block's here just to protect Mr. Kitty. Because, uh, I don't want to get him struck by lightning. Because I've been also going AFK. And uh, I've managed to get a lot of leads, and um, this wandering trader is just not wanting to give me the deal. I mean, take a look at this. 
you don't have what I'm looking for, you're gonna die. Die! 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 You better have it. Die for your sins. Die! Die! That's what you get. You have it? Oh, not again. Die! Die! Yeah, he's kind of really starting to drive me nuts. I've, I've been trying for the past couple days to get that trade, and I'm just not getting it. But hey, on the plus side, I figured out what we're going to do with all these slabs. It took me a while to come up with an idea, but I think I finally have it. What we're also going to do is use all of these ores because I figure, you know, they look updated in this update. They're a little bit different from what they used to look like. And I think that's what we're going to use to make the floor because, uh, I mean, we kind of have to have a floor in our house, right? I mean, we can't just have a sand floor. That's kind of ridiculous. So on the plus side, I think I figured out what I'm going to do with these slabs. I think, honestly, I think I'm just going to make a floor out of them just gonna literally use some of these old ores because honestly i think the new update in the ores and how they look is worth putting into this thing because it's definitely different from how they used to look you know it's just slightly different it's not it's not exactly the same and i think it looks pretty good you know and i'm just gonna kind of layer these slabs in different spots just to kind of fill in the floor and give it a unique kind of look you know because we got to build this house out of these blocks anyway so we may as well put them to good use because I really couldn't think of a real easy way to use these in the roof, you know? The roof was gonna is going to be kind of a tricky one. Because the thing is, we're going to run out of blocks pretty quickly. So, yeah. I think this should be enough to fill this whole area if we do this right. We'll see. Okay, so we got the floor situated. We used up all the slabs. We used some of the old ores mixed in there because the new textures. Got the moss block there, the moss carpet. So it's all looking pretty good. But now we got to work on the roof. And for the roof, I have a very simple idea. It's nothing too complicated. We'll see if I can do this without screwing it up. Maybe I'll screw it up. Let's see. Ah, there we go. That's what I wanted. I just wanted to get a little bit of this up here just because, you know, I think it'll look good. Put a little stair there. Let's see. We'll put a little stair here, too. We'll see if I can do that. Come on now. Come on now. Boom. Okay, cool. There we go. Okay, so for this side, we'll just put some of this. We'll put some of that. You know, nothing too crazy. Maybe a little bit of flowers just to make it look a little nice. We're going to have a hollow roof, but it's going to be a roof nonetheless. Plop in some of that copper there. You know, it's kind of a beautiful little thing. You know what I mean? Now, on this side, this is the ore wall, so we're going to make it a little bit darker. So, you know, probably put some tuff there. You know, put the, the very rare copper ore on there and the, all that other good stuff. Smooth basalt. You know, yeah, there you go. Looking pretty good. I guess we'll put some of this copper here because we need to have that somewhere. And then I guess we'll do another stair. So we'll do something like this, right? Yeah, there we go. And we'll do the same thing on this side. You know, nothing too crazy. Just put a little stair there. Boom. Okay, nice and cool. Looking good, looking good. Now, I think for the top part, this is where what we're going to do is we're going to place that there. We're going to put rooted dirt in the middle and dripstone. Now, the reason I put the rooted dirt there is because I think having a little tree on top is going to make the whole thing look nice. <laughs> My goodness, that is one heck of a house, I tell you what. I mean, we're not done yet, but um, <laughs> that's quite the house right there. All right, let's see. Let's go inside here. So I think over here on the moss block, that's where we'll put the azalea because I think that'll look good. Ooh, I just got an idea. Let's see what happens if we put one of these there. Yeah, there we go. That looks pretty cool. I think we can hang one of these from the roof. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Let's see. So we'll put some of these up here too. Yeah, not bad. I think this one we can just kind of hang. That's cool. It's like a little drapery thing. Anyway, <laughs> it's a little obnoxious. And then from the roof over here, what we could do is we can hang our glow berries. We can hang our hanging roots from the dirt up here. And then from the dripstone, we can hang a pointed dripstone. See, that's pretty cool. Let's see. Do I have string? I do. Okay, so we'll put string under each one of these just to prevent them from growing. Uh, Yeah, so that's pretty good so far. So now I think what we need to do is... We gotta get these item frames, but we're missing the glowing item frames. So let's go make one of those. All right, let's see here. Okay, there we go. We'll just make a couple of these. All right, Mr. Axolotl, you're gonna have to come with me. And let's put these item frames down. Just a couple of spots, just in case. I'm not sure how many we're gonna need, but uh, sorry, buddy, you get to hang on the wall. It's a little bit messed up, I know, but for right now, this is your home, okay, bud? Uh, just enjoy that picture frame. <laughs> we'll put all the ores down here. Nice little thing. Copper, iron, gold, all that good stuff. And then I guess we'll put the little ink sack down there. Let's see. What other items are there? Ooh, the spyglass. 
Yep, we, I guess we're going to have to throw this thing in there just because we don't have one. And the amethyst shards, so that's pretty good. I don't know if we're missing anything else, but I think that's a lot of the items so far. I'll have to check the list and see what we got left. Okay, so I just remembered we need honeycomb and string because we need to make candles. I haven't made candles yet. Yep, there it is. How many can we make? 48? That's pretty good. We don't need 48, but there's also 16 different types of candles because you can do different colors. So that's pretty cool. Can I just break it? Okay, cool. I can. Nice. So now we just need to get a bunch of dyes. Luckily, I've collected all the dyes, so we can go get the candles set up. I just need to go back to my base real quick. Okay. Oh, let's check up on these things. How have these things? Oh, oh, nice. We do have one. Okay, that was the other thing we needed, the powdered snow. Perfect. Okay, sweet. I should have a bucket. Oh, I've already got one in my inventory. Nice. So now we can cross this thing off the list. So we've got powdered snow buckets. So that's something cool. Nice. These ones are almost full, but that's good because I was going AFK looking for the uh, trading villager thing. And uh, while I was over here, I guess it filled up a little bit. Ah, uh, there's my dies. Okay, so I definitely have one of each. So we just need one of each. That way we can have one of each type of candle. Okay, so there's all the dies right there. Perfect. So we can take that back with us. Very nice. All right, well, let's head back over there and start making all these candles. That way we can cross all this stuff off the list. Ah, there we are. Home sweet home. Look at that beautiful house. Boy, it is really coming along nicely. So with the powdered snow, I guess if I right click, yeah, there it is. So now I can go inside it. Let's see, does it do it? Oh, that is so cool. It's freezing me. Does this actually hurt me? Well, it's so weird. It's like you zoom in. Oh, that's so cool. Look at that. I've got like little ice hearts. I mean, it's going to take forever to kill me, but that's pretty cool. That's a pretty cool effect. So I should be able to scoop it up. Yeah, there we go. So I guess I could place it, but I think I'm just going to put it in an item frame. I think that'll be easier. It's better than just having to like add another block because honestly, this thing's so symmetrical. I don't want to ruin it. I don't want to ruin the symmetry. Uh, We'll just put it over here behind this crystal. That should be pretty good. There we go. So we got a nice wall with all the items looking pretty snazzy, pretty snazzy. All right, let's make these candles, shall we? So I think if I do this, I should be able to just do this, put the candle and then do this. Yeah, there we go. Purple green all right i'm just gonna do this for every single color boy there should be an achievement for getting every single candle holy cow that is uh something else now i just need to find a place to put them honestly i'm probably just gonna put them on top of the house it might look pretty cool let's see we'll do one there we'll do one there boom okay so there's all the candles i think the only thing i gotta do is a regular candle but i just thought of something i forgot that you can do in 1.17 you can't do anywhere else okay i'm gonna need some of your milk thank you sir wait that doesn't make sense but okay ah yes the good old birthday cake that's right i almost forgot the most important piece is the birthday cake and it wouldn't be a birthday cake if we didn't light it there we go <laughs> So that should be almost everything. I think the only block that this house is missing is literally the, uh, what's it called? The drip leaf. I think the drip leaf is the only thing that we're missing in here because we have pretty much everything else. This is actually really cool. I actually, this has been a really fun challenge. It's just, gosh, some of this stuff just takes forever to find. I can't believe I decided to do it all in one video. I'm sorry this is so long and I'm sorry it took me so long to upload it, but hey, this has been a really fun challenge. Uh, so now I guess the only thing that we got to do is basically sit around and wait for a wandering trader to show up with the drip leaf trade. Luckily, I've got tons of emeralds. It's just a matter of playing the waiting game. So I guess that's what we're going to do now. I'll see you whenever he shows up. So while I was AFK, I managed to find myself a glow squid. But this time I decided, you know what? Let's capture him and put him inside of a little aquarium. Sounds like fun, doesn't it? It's actually not that hard. I just built a little glass tube and I pulled him in with the lead and then I sealed it up. Dropped a little name tag on this boy. That's right, that's Inky down there. And now we got a little friend. I had a uh, wandering trader show up a few times and uh, he was just not giving me what I wanted. So, you know, we had to, uh, yeah. Oh my God, I have waited so long for you, buddy. So, so long, and it is finally time. 
Oh my god, this guy has taken so long to get here, it is ridiculous. Hey buddy, I'm going to take all of the trip leaves you'll sell me. Okay, so we got 10. I'm telling you, this guy has taken us so long, and you can tell that this is a real one because you can see how these things are attached. Like, this is taking me days to get this. Like, yes, you buddy, you took forever. What took you so long, huh? Uh, my wife just had a baby. Okay, well, I'm, yeah, I'm sorry to hear that, happy. but, um, anyway. <laughs> oh, my God. We finally have the trip leaf. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Okay, so, I guess, oh, wow. Enki over here is trying to get out of the, uh, enclosure. So, earlier, I also managed to capture Enki in here. And, uh, he's one of the mobs we gotta get. He keeps, like, uh, doing this weird thing where he kind of, like, comes out of it for a little bit but he's been surviving listen to this though he makes a cool sound listen interesting okay well anyway <laughs> so i guess now what we got to do is we got to get this here drip leaf to grow up okay so for the big drip leaf i think we just have to place this here and then bam yep there it is all right so we got some big drip leaf i don't know how we're gonna get up there i think we'll just break it yep all right cool let's see uh Boom, and this stuff's pretty cool because it's like parkour stuff, so it just kind of collapses as you stay on it. Should pop back up. Yep, okay, there it is, cool. So we could use that for all kinds of fun stuff. But anyway, that's one of the blocks that we needed, so that's two things done. Yeah, we'll put a big drip leaf up here, why not? That's not too terrible. Yeah, we'll put the small drip leaf in here because why not? And here's one more thing I forgot about. You see these goats? You can milk the goats. I know it only says milk bucket, but technically it's an item. It's goat milk, so we need to add goat milk onto the uh, onto the wall here. Can't believe I forgot about that. So we got goat milk too, because that's definitely a thing. Now I would like to put the axolotls in here with Inky, but I have a feeling they'll probably kill Inky. So I need to make another enclosure just for the axolotls. Well, since we already got the pink one in there, I guess we'll put these guys in here for now. We got a little cyan one, we got a brown one, and we got a yellow one. The only one I couldn't find was the blue one, but I guess he's like super rare. But uh, you know, for right now, that's pretty good. That's four out of five, that's not bad. And then there was one more feature I forgot, and that's the sign. There we go, that's right, because now we can actually make them glow. That's it, glow and behold, nice. I think that's every new item and every new thing in the 1.17 update. I think I've literally got every single thing in here. Holy cow. Well, let me tell you, this was one heck of an episode. This took me forever to collect all of these things from the axolotls to the goats to the dang glow squid. I mean, I literally have one of every single item in this build. And this is ev how you get every single item in 1.17, at least in survival. Some of the items are not available unless if you're in survival. Wow, Inky keeps showing up. But uh, yeah, that's that's how you do it. Well, after a long time, a long journey, we managed to collect each and every item from this entire update. I mean, if you look, we've got everything in this house. Each block is a different block. And we built this entire thing out of everything from 1.17. I mean, we got all the mobs. We got ourselves these little axolotls here. We got ourselves a glow squid in a box, as pointless as that is. And even these goats. I mean, these goats are completely useless. But we got them. We did it. I mean, it, it's just its incredible when you really think about the amount of work it takes to do this. I mean, it's not really work, but like still, it took an incredible amount of time. I'm sorry it took so long to create this video, but man, I'm so glad that I did it. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, be sure to hit that like button on the way out, and I'll be sure to see you in the next one. Have a great day. Bye! Guys, I almost forgot about the lightning rod. I don't know how I forgot about this. It was just one of those things I overlooked. But there it is, the lightning rod. Okay, please don't hate me. I know I forgot, but it's there, okay? It's on there. We have it. We're symmetrical. We're all good, okay? I, I swear, I got it, okay? We're, we're still good, okay? Thanks again. I'll see you guys later. Bye!